Leaves you free to live your life as you see fit by your standards based on your judgment as an individual. So coercion is the enemy of a good life. Coercion is the enemy of the pursuit of happiness. Coercion and force are the enemies of life. The enemies of life. And therefore, to the extent that we have a political system that coerces us, to that extent, it's immoral. To that extent, it's anti-life. To that extent, it's anti-pursuit of happiness. And the only moral system, the only economic system, a social system, that actually leaves us free, leaves us alone to pursue our values, to pursue our choices, to act in ways that we judge to be right for us, is capitalism. Capitalism, therefore, is the only moral system. It's the only system that leaves the individual free to live their lives. Leaves the individuals free to pursue their own judgment and therefore their own happiness, ultimately. And even a little bit of coercion is a strain on your choices, a strain on your actions, and therefore it's immoral and therefore must be avoided in a political system.